Hello, thanks for tuning in. Another little video in the coffee grinder restoration series. Here we have a 1960s, probably, Limebrock Model 510. And, as sometimes happens, we've been taking it apart, cleaning it, and sol solving the problems, and we have discovered a loose corner block. This one's come out. I'm not going to show you the process of cleaning it up it's very simple the only thing I would say is make sure you get all the old glue off because if you don't get the old glue off the new glue won't stick properly so in this one the old block was broken so I've just made a new one from a piece of a piece of European beach and what I'm going to do is show you how to stick it in which is very simple what we're going to need is this little jig because the difficult thing in this corner is going to be clamping it up so this jig goes here on the outside and enables us to clamp up and we may also need a little block there to clamp up properly and it is as simple as that so let's do it So you can see that I've stuck a bit of cardboard in there with some double-sided tape. Reason is obviously because we don't want to damage the finish on the outside there. So that's roughly in place. These things do not have to be totally exact but they do need to fit. And luckily we've got to clamp that we can use single-handed. And basically it is as simple as that. It's clamped up. We'll now take a damp cloth, wipe off the excess glue. Even that is not crucial. And we need to let it dry. It'll take about one hour to dry as it's a joint that's not under stress. But there's no harm leaving it a bit longer. There we go. Thank you very much for watching. Gluing a corner piece back into a coffee grinder. Thanks for watching. Feel free to have a look at the links at the end of the video and in the description. And happy grinding. Mm -hmm.